Woo! This is Darren from Daily Crypto Trade Signals coming to you live from Asia. This is our 12 noon uh, update. Guys, we, I have a really uh, interesting video for you guys. We're going to talk about uh, a number of stuff. We're going to talk about uh, what Elon Musk said. Woo! Let's get it. We're going to talk about uh, some exchanges. Uh, I think you're going to find it really interesting. We're going to talk about some of the greatest news. And guys, it looks like there's been another hack that's gone on. And uh, this has been like about an $8 million uh, exploit. So we're going to talk about all of that stuff. And uh, it's really fantastic. So guys, before we get into it, uh, I just want to say, woo, thanks to all my super members. Thanks to all my subscribers for being part of this journey. And thank you very much for uh, supporting me along the way from uh, where we are today. We're getting close to uh, 45,000 subscribers. When we hit 50,000 subscribers, you know we got that one Ethereum giveaway. So you could be the lucky winner. So if you want to if you want to win, you got to be in it to win it. And all you got to do is smash the like and subscribe right now, guys. And the software that I have will automatically choose the winner. So I don't choose. Nobody chooses the software that does it. So, guys, don't forget uh, none of this is financial advice. Don't forget to smash the, smash the like button and subscribe. Get your words like that. And uh, watch out for nice cameras in the content, right? So, you know, Elon Musk, he talked, uh, he talked uh, about a lot of things uh, during the B world. And I think you guys have heard uh, a, lot of, a lot of that already. But I just want to give you my take on it. You know, Elon said he might, he might uh, pump, but he doesn't dump. Uh, you know, what do you guys think about that? Yeah, he definitely, he def he, he, he definitely, he definitely does pump. Uh, but sometimes he does in unintentionally dump. So, you know, I think sometimes uh, Elon, he does, he does stuff without thinking. So that's my take on that, you know. But, you know, so one of the more interesting things that Elon talked about was he talked about that, you know, he needed a, he needed a currency that has fast transaction speed, low fees, and that could be done on a layer one. And, you know, they were referring to Bitcoin and Bitcoin transactions and could it be the, uh, you know, the currency of the world. And he kind of said, basically, indirectly, no, Bitcoin can't do that because you'd have to build a layered layer two on top of that to make that happen like lightning or segwit so he really kind of indirectly you know uh, he really indirectly was referencing uh, dogecoin when we talk about speed and transaction fees so I, I think that's really interesting that's really bullish and you guys should also think that too so I, you know i'm all fired up you can see that you know doge right now doge is just just taking off I, I you know it's really taking off and i'm really psyched about you know doge has made a really huge recovery and uh, you can see that you know, Doge right now it's a uh, it's up. Uh, you know, 19.3. It's it's come up uh, past our support level of uh, 19.3. So that's really bullish news, guys. And you know, you can see that we're actually you know we formed that double bottom, and in fact we at 16.6 exactly as I predicted we bounced up. So that's really that's really huge news. Other other things that uh, Elon uh, said, and he, Elon said Elon Musk said Tesla most likely to restart. Uh, accepting Bitcoin payments. And I think he's gonna do that, uh, you know, before the 26th of October. I think that's absolutely gonna happen. So when that happens, tell me what you think in the comments. Do you think that, uh, you know, the uh, Bitcoin's gonna go up? Absolutely, do you think uh, Dogecoin will go up? Sure, you guys have to understand that, uh, you know, all the major altcoins right right now are linked together. Nothing is really uncoupled. The only, the only altcoin that's uncoupling from Bitcoin right now is Ethereum. Ethereum is in the process of, uh, uncoupling as we move to this uh, EIP uh, 1559 and then as we move to uh, Ethereum 2.0 when we uh, you know move from proof of work to st uh, stake of work I think this is really going to be uh, <coughs> excuse me I got a frog in my throat ribbit ribbit so I think this is really going to be a big move that uh, we'll see Ethereum uh, uncoupling from Bitcoin and I think that you know we could absolutely see uh, Bitcoin coming in at uh, at uh, around about uh, ten thousand dollars this year what do you guys think and as i said earlier the bull run is not over you know in 2011 the bull run actually had two phases it had phase one and that lasted for lasted for about 70 weeks and then we had a small um then we had a small uh, correction and then la that lasted about 11 weeks and then we had uh, part two so i think this bull run is very reminiscent of uh, 2011, so I can see that the you know really big upside coming in really soon, guys. And I think you guys should be super super excited about it. And uh, you know a lot of people have been asking me what exchange, what's a good exchange to use? Well, I use Binance. If you're in America, you have to use Binance USA. 
But Binance I bl has some of the cheapest fees, some of the cheapest trading fees, and it's been out there a long time. Not shilling for Binance. It's not a paid promotion by Binance. I'm just telling you that I use Binance. I love Binance, and I've been using it for years and years. Yeah, they're having some regulatory uh, issues right now, but that's because of the biggest exchange on planet Earth, and so they're going to get beaten up. Now, another product that you guys might like to hear about is something called Celsius Wallet. Check it out. Uh, you can check out my links in the description. Uh, and Celsius Wallet, it's a really good place to send your crypto and earn interest. And the good thing about Celsius is you can put your crypto in Celsius, and you 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 know you on Ethereum we're getting around about uh, six to eight percent APY right now, and they pay you in Ethereum. And the thing is, you don't have to lock it in there. You know, like Crypto.com, if you uh, want to get high interest, you've got to lock in for 30 days, uh, 60 or 90 days, right? And uh, if you want to take it out, you can. But with Celsius, there's no lock-in period. You can take it out anytime you want. And the good thing about Celsius is the, uh, the, the fees to send it off their platform to wherever you want, they pay for that. So you don't have to incur the fees. So I've been using Celsius for a long, long, long time, and you know I don't have any problems with it. It's really good. Another, another uh, uh, wallet or exchange which is really uh, has some of the cheapest fees, cheapest fees on planet Earth is Swissborg. Check out my links below. Swissborg, Swissborg is also very cheap, uh, and you can get that set up right away. And I think in my link, if you join up with Swissborg right away, I think you get some cash back. I can't remember, but check that out. So Swissborg is also a, a really, really, really good. Uh, exchange and and the reason I say it's good is because you know it's it's a it's kind of a simple uh, simple simplified wallet and simplified exchange but the fees are the cheapest it, it, you know onboarding and off uh, onboarding and offboarding are really easy uh, so it, it's really inexpensive and it's simple also you want to check out Luno Luno is also a really good product I also use Luno as well so these are some of the see this some of the exchange Luno is also an exchange and also a wallet you can also get interest on uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum as well uh, by staking so this is this I think Luno is one of the simplest and if you're a newbie and a beginner go to my description check out my Luno link I like Luno uh, it's really simple it's really easy it's not complicated and their KYC is not uh, over overly complicated guys so yeah you know Elon he's been talking up a storm and you know what he's been saying is complete wow for the Doge community you know I believe that Doge coin is going to be the top five coin in the future and we're definitely going to get to one dollar I just feel it in our bones I really believe that something big's going to happen you know Elon Musk he's, he's not stupid he's got big plans and you know he said that you know, personally, his biggest holdings in terms of wealth is Tesla, SpaceX, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Doge. So, you know, and when we're talking about uh, big holdings, we're not talking about a couple thousand dollars, guys. We're talking huge money in the millions, maybe even uh, billions, guys. So Doge is definitely going to go places. Uh, Elon's definitely going to been saying a lot of really positive things. And I believe that, you know, this is igniting the next bull run. So let's jump into markets, right, guys, right now. And also, too, uh, before we do that, uh, there's a there's a possible white hat hacker exploits Thorchain for eight million dollars uh, proposes a ten percent bounty. So basically, uh, a hacker went in there, uh, found an exploit, went in there and uh, took uh, eight million from uh, from uh, Thorchain, and uh, he's proposing a ten percent bounty. So basically, he's saying that he found the exploit, took the money off, he's willing to return it but he wants 10% of the 8 million so that's like 800,000 bucks he wants. So let's see how that uh, let's see how that turns out but yeah. So uh, we're seeing that you know a lot of uh, a lot of these uh, blockchains a lot of projects right now do have exploits and you that's why you guys just need to be careful. You know like I said the best way to secure your crypto is as always a hardware wallet like Ledger or Tracer Tracer wallet. I'm using Ledger and Tracer. So yeah, you know this is the best way to store your crypto. So let's jump into markets, guys. Woohoo! So right now, the uh, total market cap is uh, around about uh, one. Let me just refresh that. Let me just uh, refresh my screen. I'm looking at my screen down below, so don't beat me up in the comments. All right. So right now, the total market cap is up uh, almost three percent. It was 1.34 trillion, guys. 
and Bitcoin Bitcoin is at 32,500 so we really need to uh, get Bitcoin above 33,500 to break out past the 50 day moving average if that happens it's going to be cool beans and uh, we're, we could see 40,000 coming in really soon so we're up about 1.81 percent 24 hours that's really good for uh, Bitcoin Ethereum, Ethereum is doing really good. It's up 4.2% right now, and it's above the psychological $2,000 mark. It's at 2,055, so re that's really good. Uh, so if you're holding Ethereum, that's uh, good news. Congratulations, guys. Really fantastic. Uh, Binance Coin right now is up 1.6%, uh, and that's at 295. So uh, Binance Coin gets needs to get about $300, which is really a psychological level. Uh, before we see anything really taking off. Cardano is still at uh, $1.19. It's up almost 3%, 2.84%, guys. So Cardano needs to make some big moves too. Uh, and my Doge right now is up 2%, and that's at 19.24. So we're just, we've just fallen below the uh, 19.3 uh, support level. So we need to get that. We keep smacking against the 19.3 support level, keep getting rejected. We're kind of going you know, in a straight line and hitting that 19.3. I'm pretty sure that we can we can bounce above that because Doge right now is above the 50-day moving average and 20-day moving average on the four-hour time frame. That's important, right? Four-hour time frame. And we're still uh, well above my purple rain line. So I'm still pretty bullish that we could see uh, more momentum. I'm hoping that we can uh, definitely see Doge go up to 20 cents soon. But you know, with Elon Musk support, and I believe that, and I believe in my bones, that the Tesla announcement about uh, Tesla accepting Bitcoin is going to come really soon, guys. And remember, you guys need to understand there's a big difference between investing and trading. Remember, if you're a trader and you are a newbie in this business in crypto space and you just try to trade and day trade and swing trade or even do leverage, you will get wrecked. You will you will lose money. I don't recommend that at all. Uh, the best thing to do is if you're if you're investing, you buy, you dollar cost average in, and you hold. So if you bought Doge at 60 cents and you're still underwater, there's nothing you guys can do right now. The only thing you can do is just hodl and wait and uh, buy the dips and that brings down your total strike price, guys. So I, I know a lot of you are new here and you know you guys panic when you see things going underwater, but don't do that, guys. Uh, you know, I mean, you know, my journey in crypto, uh, you know, I started with nothing. You know, I, I started uh, my crypto journey, you know, s around about six to eight years ago. Uh, and, uh, you know, I just kind of did some mining on my computer and I thought, well, this is interesting. And then I bought a ASIC, a bit, a bit main, uh, ASIC miner. And then I realized, whoa, this is pr pretty simple. It's kind of plug and play and you get to print your own money. Uh, and then I bought another miner and another miner and another miner and another miner. And, you know, over the years, I mined about 45 uh, Bitcoin over the last six to eight years and I haven't sold any you know uh, yeah I've converted some to Ethereum I converted some to other stuff and that's really how I really started I just really started because I was just like messing around and and uh, I just started mining some coins on a PC and I thought well this is interesting you know PC is not doing anything and I'm making some you know a couple dollars here and there and then I decided to buy ASIC miner and then I just you know ASIC miner was like whoa this paid for itself in three months then I bought another and another and another and another and it just kind of snowballed and then around about I would say two and a half years ago uh, at the last halving I sold all my uh, I sold all of my mining equipment and I got out of mining because it just wasn't as profitable as profitable as it was before so I just got rid of it and I sold it and now I'm holding you know about 45 Bitcoin around about that and of course I have my doge and I have you know uh, four million doge that I bought at zero zero two five so that's really cool and you know basically I just buy buy crypto hold it and I you know I don't I take profits I mean my my profit strategy is very simple when I double my money I always take a little bit of profit you know and uh, then I take that profit because you know you need cash flow to live on right so what have I done with the profits? Well, I bought property, I bought apartments, bought lands, uh, hospitality management company, and just slowly snowballed like that. So that's how I started. You know, I didn't I didn't start with a silver spoon in my mouth. I started, uh, you know, as a university student. I was a humble waiter in a restaurant, and I worked my way up to a restaurant manager while I in college. You know, went to school, uh, got a master's degree. Uh, in uh, hospitality management and uh, you know that's it and I have a master's in IT 
and that's how I kind of did my thing and just worked my way up. So, you know, I am where I am today because of uh, hard work, perseverance, and sure, when when I started in crypto, I was like like a lot of people. They think that okay, I'm gonna day trade, I'm gonna you know swing trade and and try to buy buy the dips. At the end of the day, all the time I was spending, all the effort. I, you know, I wasn't realizing a lot of gains, and it was really stressful. And I said, I ain't doing this no more. So that's when I decided, look, I'm just gonna, just gonna mine. I'm just gonna and and hold. I just huddle and keep holding, because if you really want life-changing wealth, the best thing to do is buy low and just wait. And you know, if we see Bitcoin from 2013 to where it is now, it's gone up like a, a gazillion percent. So you just huddle for life-changing wealth, guys, and that's how you do it. So guys. Uh, I just want to say, don't forget to smash that like. This is kind of my story. Hopefully, you guys find it interesting. Smash the like, subscribe. And guys, check out my links. Check out my links. Get to smash the like, smash, smash, smash. Guys, share with your friends. Call to action. Hashtag Doge, spreading love. Make sure you get that. Make sure you get it out there. And also, call to action. Take this uh, video link. Paste it in your socials. And get the message out there for me, guys. And hey, follow me on Twitter. Come on. We're at 1,045 followers. We've got almost uh, 45,000 subscribers. We should be at least... Uh, 10,000. So guys, hit me up right now. Follow me on Twitter. And guys, don't forget to check out all my links, guys. I got a huge links. Remember, now this is financial advice once again, and I put that caution in all of my description. Guys, please support the channel right now. Become a Patreon member. Buy the channel a coffee. Go to go to uh, Kofi co-fee.com crypto squad and buy me a coffee right now and all of that proceeds go to charity uh, nft collection please check out the nft collection do it right now you guys know you want to do it check out check it check the nft collection uh, and also check out the free charting tool this is this charting tool that i'm using over and over again guys you know i'm using it you guys know you want it so check out the uh, free charting tool right now uh, be blessed i love you guys to death and uh, i'll see you in the next one guys Woohoo! See you in the next one.